Thank you for joining us today. I'm Rudy Stebby, and welcome to Episode 2, Mouse and Keyboard Commands in Windows 8 Development Preview Edition, here on Help Desk TV. In the last video, we showed you a brief overview of how to move around Windows 8 and shut down the system when done. We need to show you a couple of more mouse and keyboard commands before we can further our adventure into the new world of Windows 8. Let's start with a reminder on how to access the new Charm menu. You simply hover your mouse over the lower left corner of your desktop until the Charm menu appears. The Windows plus C combination will also bring up the Charm menu. This is how you will always return to the new Start Metro UI. You can also just hit the Windows key on your keyboard if you have it. The Alt-Tab combination still works in Windows 8 by allowing you to switch to any open app. As simply as repeatedly pressing the Tab key while holding down the Alt key until the app you wish to bring to the foreground is highlighted, and removing your finger from the Alt key will bring your app to the foreground. The Windows Tab key combination will automatically rotate amongst the open apps and bring them to the foreground. Using the arrow keys will allow you to move around the start screen. As well, using the page up or page down keys will move the Metro UI a block at a time. Windows plus the D key combination will take you to the legacy desktop view. While the Windows plus L key combination will lock the PC. A right click or a Windows plus Z key combination will bring up contextual menus on a full screen app. Right-clicking on a tile on the Start screen will bring up options to unpin, resize, and uninstall apps. A couple of more keyboard shortcuts for you. The Windows plus Y key combination makes all your open windows and the Metro UI transparent so you can see the desktop beneath. The Windows plus E key combination invokes Windows Explorer and finally the Windows plus R key combination brings up the run prompt. I hope you enjoy today's Help Desk TV. If you have a comment about this program, a question or a shortcut you'd like to share with me send us an email message to feedback at helpdesktv.ca. Thanks for watching.